or float. So first off, I got a shark. Do you think it's sink or float? Let's see. Three, two, one, three. It's a floating shark. I'm gonna see if I'm gonna float or sink on the shark.
Dragons and King, and some of them are floating. Whoa, it's cool. Okay, guys, next I got a container oh, filled with water. Do you think water will float in water? Let's see. Three, two, one. I think it's gonna hover. It sank. Wait, it went back up. I didn't even touch it. Oh, maybe if I do this. Yeah. So it's not actually sinking. It's just coming back up. And bam. Water hovers on water. I got some wooden blocks for feet. Give it a sink or float. I think it's gonna float. Three, two, one. Bam, bam, bam. It's floating. Wooden blocks float. I'm gonna build something on the water. Oh, oh, oh. And bam. Oh, 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 oh. Triangle. Oh! Hey, Ryan. Yeah? Catch. Do you guys think this is going to sink or float? I think it's going to float. Three, two, one. It's floating. Let's see if, if I hold on to it. Float. It's still floating with me. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. So, let's recap. Why does something sink or float in water? It's because of the difference in density. If the object has more density than the water, this is what will happen. It will sink. But if the object has less density than water, then it will float. Bam. Thank you for watching my sink or float experiment. Remember, always stay happy and bye bye. Bye. Yeah, we are going to test out all the objects around the house and see if it floats or sinks. So now let's put some water in the tank. So Ryan, do you know how an object sink or float? If they're No, if the object is less dense than water, because that's what the liquid we're using. If the object is less dense than water, then it will float, and if it's more dense, then it will sink. Sink, yeah. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> now that the water's filled up, let's go find some objects. All right, let's go inside and find it. Go! Let's go, let's go. Now we're going to look around the house to find some objects so we can see if they sink or float. Let's find an item and put it in this box. Hmm. What should we use? Oh, this water bottle. You want to see if a water bottle will sink or float? Okay. <laughs> A boat! A boat! This one. You think a boat's gonna sink or float? 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 Okay, guess we'll find boat. out. <laughs> what else? What else, you guys? Oh. Oh. some Diet Coke! <laughs> so Ryan wants to get the Diet Coke in the fridge. There you go. Uh -huh. You think Diet Coke's gonna sink or float? Uh, down. Sink? <laughs> Ooh, I see some balls. Like this. I found these balls. Ah. No. Ah, let's go, let's go, let's go. And yeah. I have a good idea. Here's the banana. You guys are gonna think it sink or float? Because I think it's gonna sink. <laughs> banana. Hmm, what else should I test? <laughs> no, don't put that in the water. It's either gonna sink or float, Daddy. I think it's gonna float. Float? But don't test it. <laughs> sink. Uh, let's go upstairs to look for more toys. A bunch of Hot Wheels. We have a yellow car. We're gonna test that one. Uh huh. Okay, what else should we test? All right, what about some Disney cars? Ryan, right, which one you wanna bring in? Hmm. Uh, which one to take? This. Wow. That's a big one. It's a McQueen. Yeah. Oh, what about this? This is big bus. Do you think this is gonna float or sink? No. <laughs> All right, let's try this one too. What about the pumpkin up there? Oh, this is a cute pumpkin smiling. <laughs> let's get this. Are you gonna sink or float, Mr. Pumpkinhead? I'm gonna float. So what else are we testing out? Blue bats. Now let's test out the spy truck with Marshall and Rubble in it. 
Hi. Are you guys gonna sink or float? Uh, we're gonna sink. <laughs> I'm Huddle. Woo, we have so many things. What about we test this hammer to see if it sinks or floats? What do you think? Uh, six. All right, I think we have enough object here. So we're gonna bring it outside to see if it sink or float. Here we are. Right. Do you guys think it's gonna sink or float? Do you think it's more sink? Sink. Okay. Do you think it's more dense or less dense than water? More dense. More dense. More dense. See. Oh yeah, for sure. Uh, it sure. sank. So it is sure. more dense than liquid water. What do you want to try next, Daddy? Oh, I will try this. Keep pumping. <laughs> what, what do you think, think? Ryan? Less like dense. Less dense. So it's gonna float. Yes. Is it gonna float? Is it gonna float? Ah, oh, pumpkin float! We're <laughs> so cute. I'm gonna try this. A bat? Yeah. Say sink or float? Sink. Sink? More dense. Oh, oh it floats. Float. How's it less? It's less dense. Again, it's probably because it's hollow. Yeah, there's inside. nothing inside, right? It's yeah, air. so there's air. Like air is actually less dense than water, so it helps it float. How about. McQueen. Ooh, Monster Truck, Monster Truck McQueen. Sink I think it's or float? Sink. Sink, 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 sink. More dense than water? More. More, more dense? Oh, oh you're right. more dense. Hi, McQueen. Oh, Oi. How do you feel being in water? Are you ready to go for a swim? <laughs> what object do you want to test next? What's next? <laughs> no. No. My Pokemon. Pokemon. Sink or float? Oh. No. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's gonna float? Okay. I think it's hollow. Is there a Pokemon inside? My Ooh, Pokemon! It floats, look at that. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, even if you put it down, it pops back up. Oh, it's my turn? Yeah. I'll pick my favorite drink, Diet Coke. Ooh, Diet Coke, sink or float? I think it, it sinks. Wait, is there anything in there? Yeah, yeah. Diet Coke. It's sink, open. Sink, 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 sink. I okay. think so too. Let's see. What's your guess, mommy? I think it's gonna float. It's gonna float? Yeah. What do you say? Go. Oh, it floats! It floats! How? I knew it. Because Diet Coke doesn't have the, it has the fake sugar in there. It doesn't have sugar in there to weigh it down. Daddy's gonna see if he can find a regular soda that's not diet and see what happens. Yeah. Daddy Coca -Cola. found the regular soda. All right. All right. Let's see. So because it has sugar in there, it's gonna make it more dense than water. Let's see if it's true. You guys ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Let's see. It is going down more. Maybe it just takes time. But regular soda sinks. It just takes time. Yeah. Woo. I want the banana. Banana Ooh. sink or float? I think it floats. More dense or less dense than water? Uh, the less. Less dense? You guys both think it's, think it's gonna float? Yeah. Come on, really? Ah, float. What? I didn't know that. Banana is less dense banana than water. Banana can't swim. <laughs> oh, like peanut butter jelly, peanut butter jelly. It's peanut butter jelly time. All right, Daddy, what else should we try? Stress ball. Ooh. <laughs> oh. Ooh, it floats. What about this one? Well, what about that one? Oh, oh they both, both float. float. All right, all right, your turn. What do you want? <laughs> you know what I'm gonna do. What? <laughs> what is that? The boat Ryan made. Boat. Oh, boat. Sink or float? Float. It's gonna float? float? Okay. Because it's a boat. Yay! Ooh, it's floating! Chugga chugga choo choo. What? Is that what? a train? <laughs> Why is that sound? Okay, what about, you think it can hold a ball? Oh ah! no! Ah! Honey, it's sinking! There's so much water inside now. Pokeball overboard. Ah! Oh no! It's not submarine, Ryan. <laughs> I broke. Oh no, no, it's just a sheet of paper. Yeah. What about a sheet of paper? Sink or float? If it's flat? Uh, float. Float? Okay, let's see. Oh yeah, <laughs> it does float. Float! What about if you crumble it up into a ball? Like this? Yeah. Float! No sink! But there's nothing in it! Let's see. Oh, there is something in it. Oh, oh, oh. it floats. No, nope, it floats. Okay, what else do you want to try, Ryan? How uh, about this one? Yeah. Miss Frizzle? All right. From Dizzy Cars. It looks Let's heavy. See. It looks heavy. Sink, 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 sink. sink. Oh. It'll float. Oh, it floats. Hey, it's this... a water toy. Oh, it's a water oh. toy? That's why. Oh, it's meant to float. I forgot. Uh, what's this button do? I think you put it into water. Let it soak up some water. And then uh -huh. it squirts. <laughs> you guys see the squirting from the horns? Yeah. The race is on. Oh, 
splash you. Hey, hey, no, don't splash me, no. Kids keep splashing my face. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want to try next? I want to try... Yourself? Brian! <laughs> Myself. <laughs> I want to try... This. Whoa, got a Paw Patrol fire truck. And it floats. Oh. It floats. Even if the Marshall and Rubble here? Floats, still floats. Still floats. Oh, oh, puppy overboard. What else do we have here? We have water bottle. Take your float, Ryan. Nope. Yeah. It floats. Because there's air inside. Yeah. Well, there's a tiny bit. Woohoo. Last thing Last is the thing. Hot Wheel. Hot Wheel car, sink or float? Mr. Ryan. Uh, Sink? Okay, Ryan says it's gonna sink. Oh. oh, you're right. Definitely sink. All the way to the bottom. Did you guys guess which one's gonna sink or float? I'm a toy. You're also a toy? <laughs> Ryan toy review? Right toy. Right toy? <laughs> now we're gonna make the water blue. So blue. Yeah. Whoa. It looks like a rubble is swimming. Rebel, you swimming? You having a swim? Hi hey guys, today we're going to do a science experiment with pencils. And we're going to poke these pencils through a Ziploc bag, and the Ziploc bag will have water inside it. Whoa, whoa, Ryan, so that means that the, all the water is going to leak through, Ryan. That's what you think. Uh -huh. First, let's put water inside the bag. Okay, let's fill it up. Do, 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 do. Hopefully Ryan's telling me the truth, because... I don't want a big mess. Now we're gonna put in food coloring for fun. I'm gonna use blue. All right, maybe one drop. Right. <laughs> 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 look at the color. Ah, nice. Look at the ocean. Next up, we're gonna need a sharpened pencil. Don't forget to ask your grown up for help. All right, here we go. We're gonna poke it through. Three, two. Is it gonna work? Yeah, it's not gonna make a mess. All right, it's poking through. Whoa. Look, the pencil's inside! <laughs> oh. oh no way, guys! There's no water coming out! What? Why is it like this? How's it working, Ryan? Whoa! Do more, Ryan. Okay, I'm gonna do a bunch of pencils. Whoa. What? What about you try, Daddy? Hmm? Ooh, can I do it? Alright, let's see. I'm gonna do it at an angle. Does it work? Ooh. Whoa, it works! Whoa! Whoa. Cool. Daddy did it from up to down. Alright, I'm gonna do it from the opposite direction. From up, down. Whoa! Whoa, it's working! Yeah, it is! Well, I'm gonna do more. Whoa! Oh! Whoa. Whoa! There's so many pencils. Ooh. All right, I'm gonna keep going. Woo. Woo. Let's see if I can do all of them. Woo. Oh. Oh, oh, hot. Ah, I think I poked too much. Oh. Oh. Daddy, what about we take out all the pencils and see what happens? Ooh, good idea. Just in case, let's put in the ball, right? All right, let's see what happens. Water's coming Whoa. out! Uh -huh. There's so Whoa. much water! Water! Waterfall! Water those! <laughs> Whoa, look at that! Well, there's so much water coming out. Like a shower! It's a waterfall of water. Mm. Whoa, there's so much! I am gonna squeeze. Get water out. Whoa! Ah! Whoa! 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 Big mess. Wow! It almost filled up the whole thing. Thank you for watching a science video about pencils poking through a bag. Thank you for watching our video. Bye. Remember, always stay happy and rise up. Bye. Bye. Ciao.
Guys, today we're going to see which soda can sink or flow. That's right, we're going to drop those soda cans in the fish tank over here filled with water and we're going to see which one will sink and float and why. First I want to try this one. That Dr. is Dr. Pepper. Pepper. Okay, let's see. Sink or float, what do you guys think? I think it's going to float. All right. It's going to sink. It's going to sink? Okay. Right. Yeah, it sinked all the way down. Whoa, brine's in water. Whoa, bubbles. <laughs> yeah, so why does things sink and why does things float? Ryan knows this. Because the density is too high or too low. That's right. If the density is higher than water, it will sink. Oh, and if the density is lower than water, it will Whoa. float. And if it's the same density, it will like hover in the water. Good job. Good observation. And one. the density of water is one. One what? One. One gram per milliliter. One <laughs> gram per milliliter. There's other units, but yeah. Okay. Ryan wants to test out. Pepsi. Pepsi. Regular Pepsi. What do you think? It's gonna sink. It's gonna sink? Okay. Let's see. I was correct. Wow, they both sink. Whoa. 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 It was Whoa. For a little bit. Yeah, it did. You guys see that? <laughs> okay. Whoa. What else do you want to test out? And then Coca-Cola. Yes, yeah, so but this bottle is smaller though, Ryan. This can is smaller, so what do you think if it's smaller? I think it might float. Float? Okay, let's see. Oh, it's gonna float. Oh, look, 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 look. It floats. It floats? What? Or is it the same density? Maybe, what? Come on, we're gonna wait a while and see what happened to that Coke can, okay? okay? Do all the small bottle float? Let's try to push it down, let's see what happens. What? It just goes back, it just hovers on there, wow. Okay, let's try a smaller bottle too. Let's see if it makes a difference. Oh, okay. Let's do this one. But that's diet Pepsi. Do you think diet and regular have a difference though? No. Let's see. We will put it on top. It's probably gonna fall off though. <laughs> what? They both float. Oh, wow. Oh, this one a little bit more. Uh, <laughs> it's like, I'm gonna go back up. <laughs> Interesting. Coke, I don't think it's gonna float. The Diet Coke? That's Diet Coke. Let's right. see. <laughs> Wait, what? 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 Is, but that's a big can too, Ryan. Yeah. Why does it float? Huh, we gotta put more and see. What? What is going on? What? And this is Coca-Cola, but big version. That's right. So the small version float. What about the big version? Wait, let me see how heavy this is. Oh, this is way heavier. I don't, I think it's gonna sink. <laughs> Look at that. Whoa. What? How? What is going on? That Coke there is still, wait, oh, sinking, oh, 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 oh. The small can float, but the big can sink. But then that's a big can, but it still floats. So, yeah. interesting, okay. Huh? Let's do Sprite. That's a diet Sprite. So what do you think, Ryan? The no sugar gonna float or sink? It sink. It sink? Okay. What, 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 what? What is happening? What? Oh, interesting, right? So both a diet giant size float. Ryan's trying to push it down. Go down. Oh, it actually goes back up. Let's do uh, MVP. So this is Coke Zero. That's right. So this is also Coca Cola, but it's zero, so it doesn't have sugar in there. It's different type of chemical. It's gonna float. Different type of uh, sweetener. Yeah. Sweetener. It floats too. What is going on, it's Ryan? Why? Huh. And these are we already. Oh, there's a smaller version. Okay, smaller Sprite. Let's see. That's also no sugar. Ryan smelling it. <laughs> we never tried this one yet. That's sugar. Okay, that's a regular Sprite and it has sugar. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's going to float. Yep. Oh. Wait, oh, wait, oh, wait, oh, wait. <laughs> it sank. 
Whoa. Whoa. What do you observe with all these soda cans? All the diet ones float. That's right, except for this one. That's not diet, but it's float. And what happened to all the regular sodas? They all sink. They all sink, yeah, except for this one. So I actually found another can here. It's a small version. It's regular, so we're gonna test it out and see. Do you think it's gonna float oh, or sink? It's so cold. Yeah, it was in the fridge, so. Yeah, it's gonna float. Okay, let's see. Oh, so it also floats. So I guess the smaller cans, they float, they float, but the giant can sink. But if it is giant can, but if it is diet, it floats, right? Yeah. Do you know why the diet one floats? But then the regular ones sink all the way to the bottom. Sugar? The sugar, good job. So I think these float is because they're smaller cans. So, that one floats. so it doesn't have as much sugar, so it'll still float. See? Yeah, that's so cool. Brian wants to try a regular water bottle. <laughs> Let's see what happens. I think it's gonna sink. Sink? We know it's gonna float. Ooh. Whoa. It's hovering. <laughs> Maybe it's the same density. Because there's water inside. That's it. right, same density as water. So all the one with sugar is sinking on the bottom. Do you know how much sugar are in sodas? Uh, no. A lot. <laughs> but before we get to that, let's test out other items around the house. Let's go. Okay, let's go. So we're gonna go and get some items around the house and test them out. Now we gathered stuff around the house, and these are real. <laughs> Okay, so which items you want to try first? I'll try the baseball. Ooh, okay. I think it's squishy gonna... toys, not a real baseball. It's gonna float. It's gonna float? Whoa. Well, definitely float here. Whoa. <laughs> I didn't know that this was less density. Yeah, it is less dense than water. That's why it's like staying on top. <laughs> what else? This. A sponge? This sponge. Secret yeah, float. Let's get it. Let's get it wet. Wait, doesn't this make it like heavier? Yeah. Float. Wait. Still so float. If we put water in it. Nope. Still float. <laughs> right, trying to push it down. Oh, wow. Whoa. Still float. Wow. It's like you're not getting me down, Ryan. <laughs> we can try this. Okay, so we have a quarter. Yeah, but it's gonna be probably a different result with the penny and stuff. Maybe I don't know. Oh, it just went all the way down. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. You guys see it? It's right there. So it's sinked. Definitely way more dense than water. Yep. <laughs> and now we got this Nerf bullet. Let's see. Sink or float. Whoa. It's like a sponge, huh? It just like stays on top. Whoa. <laughs> That's cool. And now we can try this. Avocado. Real. Real avocado. Sink or float, you guys. Oh, it's going up, Ryan. It's going up. It's going up. Let's try to push it down. Is it gonna work? Is it, is it, is it, is it? Nope. It is it. I can scoop it up. Scooping it up. <laughs> I got an idea. So we can put this in. Uh -huh. Oh, that's definitely safe. Got it. Now what if I... Scoop, scoop the avocado up, and then drop it. Oh, oh, I have an idea. What if I do this? It's a helmet. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> now we can try a small Nerf bullet. Ah, ah. Definitely float. And this glasses, it is 100% UV protection. Yay. Bye bye. <laughs> so there you go. If you ever drop your glasses in the pool, it's going all the way down. <laughs> so make it water protection. Yeah. Now we can try baseball. Juggling ball. Juggling ball. <laughs> yeah, there you go. It's gonna float. Yeah. Yeah. Apple is floating too. Wow. Orange. Whoa, they all oh. float. All the fruits so far that we have in here float. So, so far, most of it floats. Yeah, look at that. Oh, except this avocado is staying down this time. What, 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 what? Wow, what? look at that. <laughs> no way. 
Is there too much water inside or something? Maybe, I don't know. What? Well, it's sinking now. Oh, mm. wait, let me see. Try to try to dry it off. What? Maybe the water got inside and weigh it down. Yeah. <laughs> All the Cokes that sink, we notice that they're regular Cokes with a whole bunch of sugar inside, right? Yeah. So Ryan's gonna pick up the Coca-Cola. Uh-huh. And we're gonna figure out just how much sugar is inside. Yeah. Okay? So each Coca-Cola bottle on the back will have a label. And you notice here it tells you exactly how much sugar is inside. It'll tell you. It says total sugar, 39 grams. And then here is a Diet Coke. And if you notice here, the total sugar actually says zero. But because there's no sugar, they actually added other chemicals in there to make it the taste the same. So it's actually not good for you either. But we're gonna see how much sugar is inside this Coke. So this Coke, it says it has 39 grams of sugar, right? Uh -huh. Okay, I'm gonna cup on here. I'm gonna zero it out. Ryan's going to put lots of grams. Sugar in there to, to it reach 39 grams. Nine grams. Eight, eight grams. Eight grams, okay. No, eight grams. Still not 39 grams of sugar. What Whoa. Okay, right now we're at 32 grams of sugar. So I should put a little bit now. 34, 34. grams of sugar, yeah. This should be 30, oh, oh. 37. Okay, so. Slowly. Oh, there it is, 39. Oh, 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 Good job, oh, oh. Ryan. So this is how much sugar that is in this Diet Coke here. Whoa. So that's why it weighs it down and it sinks. <laughs> is it good to drink sodas all the time? Yeah. Why? Because they have a lot of sugar. A lot of sugar, yeah. And also they have chemicals. That's right, good job. It has bad chemicals for your body, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay guys, I hope you guys have fun learning with Ryan about density and about how things sink and flow. <gasps> what? This is 370 grams. Well, the whole container is 370 yeah. grams? Yeah. Let's see. There it is, guys. 370 grams for the whole container. But that's also including the container. Yeah. <laughs> Back to where we were doing. We're talking about thank you for watching and learning with Ryan. Hope you guys have a good day and learn about density and learn about why things flow and learn about why it's not good for you to drink so much soda, yeah. right? Hi, guys. Today we're making homemade lava lamps like this. Okay, so you have to wait a little bit and look what's gonna happen. Look. That's cool. You like it? Yeah. So here's what you need. Bottles, food coloring, alka seltzer, oil, and optional if you want it, glitter. Yeah, so this one we have glitter inside, but you don't need glitter. <laughs> First step, always ask a grown-up for help. Daddy! What's up, Ryan? Hi. Hey, what do you need help on? I need help on baking this lava lamp. Okay, here we go. So we got oil. I need three, four oil in each container. All right, right on, Ryan. So put the funnel like this. Funnel. So you won't spill the oil all over. Yeah. Whoa. Are going in? Yeah. Oh. Fold it up, go, let's go, let's go. You see it coming down? Yeah. One down and three to go. All right, let's keep going. Oh, it's done, now fill the rest with water. You do that and I'll tell you when to stop. Oh, oh, never mind, I'll do it, I'll do it. Mm. <laughs> Always ask for adults for help. I'll tell you when to stop. Okay. okay so the water starts to move. Stop. Perfect. Perfecto. Next, we're gonna keep doing it. Okay, Ryan, just take a close look and just tell me when to stop. Counting on you. Because you cannot overfill either. So, oh, perfect. We're gonna done here. If you look here, there's two layers. There's water on the bottom and there's oil. So yeah. oil and water doesn't mix, right? Yeah. Why? Why? <laughs> yeah, why, why doesn't water and oil not don't mix? Do they hit, hit each other? No. Water and just boils the same. Is that why? No? Because water is more density. Oh. Good job, Ryan, because they have different density. Yeah, That's water is down. more dense yeah. than oil. And okay. now we're gonna put food color in. First one is green. Okay. 
Maybe 10 drops would be enough. Wow, oh, you see how it goes all the way down? Oh. <laughs> like going down. There yeah, go. let's shake it up a little bit. Just make sure you drop all the uh, food coloring to the bottom. Whoa. Isn't it interesting how it only colors the water and not the oil? Yeah. Uh -huh. What is that? That I don't know, for real. <laughs> <laughs> Next, we're gonna do... Orange. Orange. There you go. Again, 10 drops. Mm -hmm. good, good. Oh, it's slowly going down. Oh, that one just staying there. Oh, is it gonna go up? Wait, once it goes up. Oh, it looks so cool. It's like a Whoa. little bubble of uh, food coloring. Get hit. Oh, I got ah. him. <laughs> That's so cool. Whoa. That's cool. I think it's gonna just stay there. But I gotta mix it up, so I'm sorry. It can't stay there forever. <laughs> Mix it up. I don't think he's. Oh. Yeah, it's going down. See? Oh. Eventually, all go down because it's higher density than oil. I'm gonna try. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. it's like a washing machine. Uh, okay. Good. Looking good, Ryan. Looking good. Right, let's do. Ooh, rose pink. Oh, there you go. Whoa, whoa. That's 20. Yeah. Close the cap. And mix it up. Is it going? I want to do it. Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. Do it, do it, do it. There you go. Perfect. Wow. You're doing much better than me. Good job. They kind of look almost the same. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Pink and orange look the same. The last one Pepe. is purple. Pepe. This one works. There you go, there you go. Eh. Alright, good job. Eh. Oh, they're floating! Ah. Bobby. You gotta get that down, Ryan. Mix it up, please. Okay. Wow, cool. I don't think it's tough. So ah, there, there. Stubborn. I don't want to go down. Okay, here it's going through. Good, good. It's working, Ryan. Whoa, look at that. Nice, perfect. Next step, alka seltzer. Okay, so the piece is a little big, so we gotta break it up. Ah, that's easy. Get it. Oh, good job, Ryan. Alright. Let's do it together. Three, two, one, one. go. We're gonna see which one there. looks cool. Close the cap. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, not that way, upside down. <laughs> oh, it's going crazy. Look at yours. Whoa. I like yours, Ryan. There you go. This one looks good, actually. Let's see. Do you mind? Oh. Close it before it explodes. <laughs> oh, I like the orange one too. It looks Whoa. so cool. And the pink one. See, it, it like, does look pink. It like, looks like actual llama. Yeah. I like it. Whoa. So when it comes out, it looks pink. Wow. I like the orange one because it's actually lava. Yeah, it does look like lava. <laughs> nice. So there it is. Super easy and simple homemade experiment. <laughs> Thank you for watching our video about lava lamps. Bye. Remember, always stay happy and rise up. Bye. Bye, guys. Let us know which lava lamp is your favorite <coughs> color. Oh, my favorite's pink. My favorite is blue. Blue, because we had the glitter in it. Yeah. It's really cool. All right, Hello. guys, bye. Bye. Hi, guys. Today we're going to make an exploding volcano. This is what it looks like inside. And now we're going to put it together. So first, you're going to need one fourth cup of vinegar. And don't forget to ask your grown up for help. Hi. Poof. Next app, food coloring, I'm gonna need a spoon. Next app, the vinegar into the volcano. Whoa! Three, two, one. Whoa! What's coming out? Whoa! Whoa. Volcano! A blue volcano! Now we're gonna make rainbow explosions. First, add vinegar up to here. Next, add 
Next, add a couple drops of your food coloring. Okay, and now I'm going to add green. Next, add your baking soda. Three, two, one. Whoa! Whoa! You just came out like, oh, more's coming! Is it gonna come back up? It won't. Now for the blue one. Whoa! Whoa, there's so much blue! Is it gonna come down and go back up again? It will! I think, 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 think. Okay, let's do the next one. Now for the green. Today we're making rain clouds in a jar. Talking about rain clouds, guys. I think there's one right now. Ah, ah, excuse me for a second. I need to use this emergency umbrella. I think it's done now. Now we can actually make a rain cloud. Don't forget to ask your grown up for help. And first, you're gonna need to put water inside your jar up to here. That's why I'm here to help you. Poof. Next, use shaving cream, and that's going to be the cloud. <laughs> and you're going to need a lot of cloud. That's enough. Whoa. <laughs> and then you're gonna get some water and you're gonna put it like a quarter, like up to here. Okay, then you get your favorite four colors and then you're gonna add the colors that you got into here. Green. And yellow. And blue and red. Okay guys, are you ready to see some rainbow rain? Yeah, so this is the cloud and you're pretending this is the air. When you get too much of the water, the cloud is going to release the rain like so. Oh, the cloud is still holding the rain. Like it's dropping. Stop holding it. Now, I ordered you to stop. <laughs> stop now, you've got to go down. Any moment now. Do you see how it's falling already, Ryan? Yeah. Look at the red, and now you're doing some blue. Well, this is a very strong rain cloud. Ryan is just <laughs> mixing all the colors together. Look at the rain go. We're gonna do it all together. Wow! It is a rainbow, rain cloud thingy. What do you mean? Whoa, there's so much green. <laughs> Look, I think there's so much green because the, the blue and the yellow mixed to green 
And also those green by itself. Yeah, wow. Is this a rain cloud or is this a green cloud? Green cloud. <laughs> is there any part that's not green? No. No. I think you put too much green. <laughs> but it looks cool on top. Yeah, it does. Okay guys, so that is a very easy way to learn about rain cloud. Yeah, it is. Did you have fun? Yeah. All right guys, thank you for watching. Bye. Remember, always stay happy and thrive. Bye. Bye. So do the opposite of rain, because it goes down. <laughs> Bye guys. Bye guys. Today we're gonna be making a rainbow baking soda and vinegar science experiment. Are you guys ready? Okay guys, first step is you're just gonna need a cup of baking soda and then your favorite color. So what color are you guys gonna add? Green! Okay, go ahead. Kate did some red, Emma did some green, and Ryan did... I don't even know. Blue. Next, you're gonna need to agitate to so get something to agitate. Hey, agitate. Can I agitate now? Yeah. Agitate, agitate, agitate. There you go. Agitate, agitate. Here. Good girls. Good Emma. Good Ryan. Look guys, mine's almost fully blue. Wow, yeah. Keep agitating, good. I can mix it a little more. I'm gonna mix it a little more. Yeah, so you guys, colors are coming good. See, red, green, and blue. Good girls and boys. Okay, so we done with our three cups. Now we're gonna do these three. Okay, so Kate's going to do orange, okay. and then Emma's gonna do yellow, yellow. and then Ryan's gonna do purple. Good. Yeah. There you go, add your color, purple. This doesn't look like yellow. <laughs> it will. Good, there you go, yellow. Looks like Kate orange. got her orange. Okay, I think that's enough. Okay, there it is, purple's out, but it's okay. Woo, look at the Whoa. bubble. <laughs> look at that giant purple bubble. All right, start agitating. There you go. Agitate, agitate. Agitate, 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 agitate. Okay, we got our rainbow colors. Nice. Okay guys, so now we're gonna pour all the colors into this pan here. So Kate, you can start first with red. Pour it in. Yeah. There we go. Okay, we got our red, and now we're gonna do our orange. All right, there we go, orange. Ooh, Ooh. nice. Ooh. Good job, Kate. Next is yellow. There you go, good, I help you. It's okay, there you go, good girls. Wow, so beautiful, huh? Yeah, it's like a rainbow. Yeah. Can we do the whole thing? There you go. Oh, this is a rainbow. Now we do blue. Good. There you go. Yeah. Beautiful. Okay, so we accidentally forgot the green here. So Ryan's going to pour the green. Yeah. There we go. Whoa. <laughs> it's okay. We Whoa. can fix it. Spread out the green. It looks pretty, huh? Yeah. It's actually a lot of green. Yeah. It's like a rainbow, but now we need purple. That's right. Purple. Yeah. Wow, so beautiful. Mom can, now mom can these yeah, almost done. Good job, okay. guys. You're gonna need some vinegar here. Yeah, yeah, of course. Okay, I'm gonna pour some vinegar in each cup for you guys. Okay, there you go. Pick up some vinegar and then just do it. Yeah. Emma, squeeze. Like this. Can you see the bubbles? Emma, look. Whoa. Okay, look. I put some bubbles. <laughs> Wait, are you mixing Whoa. Let's just mix it over there. Okay. Whoa, that's a big one. I have a reaction inside Whoa. my cup. Whoa. That's cool. Whoa. There's this spot you guys haven't done yet. Okay, I'm gonna do it on one single spot. Okay. 
Whoa, that's giant. Another one. Wow, look at the bubbles. Okay. okay, we're gonna pour it now. Whoa! 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 Can I touch it? Yeah! Can I touch it on my hand? Look at this! Whoa! It looks so cool! <laughs> that was fun, huh? Yeah! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa. That's super cool. Yeah. Thank you for watching our baking soda and vinegar rainbow science experiment. Bye. Remember, always stay happy and rise up. Bye. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Hi, guys. Today we're going to make ooh black and once we're done we're gonna make it vibrate like this all you need is cornstarch and water aqua okay so you're gonna need two full cup of cornstarch whoa Whoa. One, one, two. Now my mom's gonna put in food coloring for me. So this is optional. You can put any color you like. Ryan likes purple, so I'm putting in. And one cup of water. Don't forget, always ask a grown-up for help. And never eat your science experiment, correct? Yeah. <laughs> Here we go. Whee! Time to mix. Okay, so while Ryan's mixing, I'm gonna actually make my own so I can pick different colors. So, again, two cups of cornstarch. One, two. Ooh, ah. I'm gonna pick red. So red. Whee. Okay, and one cup of water. Whee. Oh, look, it's looking red already. Time to mix. We're having Mommy. a agitating mixing party. Mommy, it's already yes. kind of working. Oh, nice. Yeah. See? Done. Wow. <laughs> okay, it's done. Whoa. Look at this. It's like slime. Yeah. It's so liquidy. I'm going to make a ball. <laughs> and I have a, a ball. Oh, it's melting ball. Whoa. Whoa, look how it's melting through my fingers. Yeah, it's so cool. <laughs> how much can you pick up, Ryan? I can pick up a lot. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, that's so cool. <laughs> hey, Ryan, do you know if Ooh Black like this it's a solid or liquid? I think it's a solid. Uh-huh. And it's a liquid. It's called non-Newtonium fluid. Oh, so Ryan already knows. That's right. So what happens is when you pick it up, it flows down like a liquid, right? When you, if you squeeze it really hard, it feels like a solid. Yeah. I'm I'm trying to pick it up like really weak and using barely any energy and it's uh, really easy. <laughs> Why are you trying to punch at it and what does it feel like when you punch at it? Here, boxing gloves. It's really hard to punch. It is because it's a solid. Yeah. Okay, Ryan, are you ready to make other colors? Yeah. All right, one, two, three, snap. Yeah. Whoa. Whoa. So there it is, we made all different color ooh black. So we got pink, we got orange, we got blue, we got yellow, and green. Now, let's make a vibration party.
Okay, guys, we got a giant speaker. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna need something with a lot of bass so we can see the ooh black vibrate. Now, before we begin, the music's gonna be very, very loud. So, there we go. Get noise cancellation headphones. Okay, Ryan, do you even hear me? Ryan? Oh, he doesn't even hear me. Okay, guys, let's get the ooh black and let the dance party start. Are you ready? He's ready. <laughs> Okay, here we go. I'm pouring it in. I'm so excited. Okay. Whoa! Whoa. Okay guys, that was like the most amazing thing. We're gonna clean up and we're gonna test out mine, okay? Mm -hmm. Now we're gonna try out the red ooh black. What? What? Red? Okay, all right guys, let's get the party started again. Here we go. Whoa, Whoa look at that. why the vibration makes the ooh black jump up and down to have a dance party? I think so. Why? Do you know? You want me to explain it for you? Because the vibration like makes it move, so it's like... Oh, <laughs> that's right, yeah. But here's also another reason why. The dancing parts of the ooh black are actually sound waves moving through the solution. If you change the pitch or frequency of the music, the sound waves will make the ooh black dance differently. Thank you for watching. Remember, always stay happy and rise up. Bye. Bye. And be very careful because your hands will get dirty. So you have to wash it with soap. Bye. Hi guys, today we're making a bubble inside a bubble. So first, you put this water. It's not special. Yeah, so it's about one cup of water. Next, you need one tablespoon of sugar and then pour it into your one cup of water. And the sugar will make the bubble more unbreakable. <gasps> then you'll need two tablespoons of Dawn soap. One. Two. Next, you agitate. Agitate, agitate. 10 hours later. <laughs> Next, put the mixture all over the table. And then you spread it out. 
So next you get yourself a straw and then dip it into the mixture. And then you put it here and you blow. Whoa. Whoa. Very cool. Ah, <laughs> like an egg loop. Oh, it's a giant one now. Uh -huh, you're gonna need more bubbles. <laughs> Whoa, look, you almost did it. Whoa. <laughs> okay, so Ryan's gonna try and I'm gonna try too. You just dip it in and then you just blow. Oh, there it is. Oh, nice, you did it, Ryan. Right? Oh, like a bubble inside a bubble. Okay, a bubble inside, inside a bubble inside a bubble. <laughs> so close. <laughs> okay, we're gonna keep trying. Okay, whoa, Ryan, look at him. He put a bubble inside a bubble. Whoa. <laughs> All right, guys, we're gonna try to do a flower. Okay. Eat a lot of that. Already made a little bit, huh? Yeah, that looks cool. <laughs> Whoa. I'm gonna try to make the biggest bubble. Whoever can make the biggest bubble win. Okay. Bubble contest, let's see. Does that count? <laughs> what? <laughs> Bubbles. That's Ryan. Who's winning? Hey! I'm still making it ah. Well, I can move mine. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. We're gonna tell you to play our bubble. That's how you make a bubble inside a bubble inside a bubble. If you want, thank you for inside watching. A bubble inside a bubble inside a bubble inside a bubble inside a bubble. Remember, always stay happy and rise up. Bye. The bubbles are gonna rise up. That's a good one. Whoa! Guys, today we're gonna be doing the raisins in soda experiment. So first, you're obviously gonna need some raisins. Next, you need some soda, and then you put it into a cup. I'm gonna use a funnel so that it doesn't spill. Okay. Here. And bam. Oh, there's more. Oh, there's more. Okay. Oh. Oh. Bam. Do you guys see all the bubbles? That's the carbonated gas. Next, get another container and fill it up with water. Okay. Do you guys see any bubbles here? Nope, because the water does not have any gas, but the Sprite does. Next, I'm gonna put some raisins in the Sprite and some raisins in the water. And let's see what happens. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Whoa, there's a lot more bubbles now. More raisins. More! More! Whoa, guys, there's so many more bubbles now. Whoa. Now let's try it in water. See what happens? Hmm, nothing is happening. Okay, let's put some more. Hmm. Nothing is happening in the water but there's a lot more bubbles whenever I put it in the Sprite. Wait guys, this raisin is floating back up. It's going up, and then one's going down. That one's staying up, oh, now it's going up. Oh, now it's going down, oh, now it's going down. Whoa. Hmm, 
On the water side, it all stays the same. It always sinks to the bottom. But on this side, it's going up, and then it goes down. And then it goes up, and then it goes down. And then up, and then down. So here's how it happens. When the raisins are dropped into the soda, it sinks to the bottom because the raisins are more dense than the soda. When the soda releases carbon dioxide bubbles, the bubbles will attach around the outside of the raisins. With enough bubbles around the raisins, it helps lift the raisin up to the surface of the water. However, when the bubbles pop, the raisin will sink back down again. This continues over and over until all of the carbon dioxide gas escapes. That's why some of the raisins go up and then down for the soda, but for the water, it stays down the whole time. Wow! Up, down, up, and down. Okay guys, thank you for watching my raisins experiment. Remember, or stay happy and rise up. Bye! Up, down.